Hey there, friend. If this is your first time watching one of my videos, welcome. And for everyone else, welcome back. Thank you for joining me for another episode of Life is Feudal Forest Village. If you want to see the journey from the very beginning, you can click the link in the description below. And um, I'd really like to hear from you, so please leave a comment if you would like. Let's get started. Um, last time that we were playing, we um, were still trying to get more fish because our fish is just super low. And we just got the sheep pasture recently. We also discovered pigs. We created some more farms. We got a second cow. And we're going for another um, donkey so that we have an extra one just in case this one gets old and passes away. So um, I think what we're going to do this time is work on getting the pigs. So let's do that. Um, And we just are starting to build this house here, so um, we'll have more people to work again in... Oh wait, I need to take people out of the farm. Take people out of the farms, out of the... that. Oh, no, I don't need more people in there. Um, get some more people in here. And... Put somebody in the weaver shop because that's dropping. What else? We have enough room in the school. Yeah. Okay. So let's see. If I let's get rid of the trees here and see, maybe we'll put the pigs in here or something. That sounds like a good idea to me. Eventually, these are gonna get taken out once we get um, low. And I need to start planning where we're going to put these eventually. Let me just see really quick where... How do we get to that again? Okay. So the stone one's probably going to be the one that we do next. Mm -mm. We have some a good amount of stone in here. Um, I don't think we can even build in here. Let's see. We can do up here, but I'm going to be building in here sometime soon. So that's going to be... A little bit difficult. If I did somewhere in here, I'd be right next to this, which would be nice because it could just go directly into there. But these, are, there's not a whole lot in here, so I might still just do like down in here or something like that. What about this stuff? Ooh, there's a lot of ore over here and over here, so that's not a problem. And then clay has a decent amount. So that really the stone mine is the one that I'm gonna have to have them walk farther for, but, um, okay, let's see. I am gonna have more people go into here. Um, okay, that warehouse is built. That's good. Let's plan ahead for the farms really fast. So we're gonna want more grass, just so we have extra for the, these guys. We're going to continue with grass there. I'm going to do some more potatoes because we're running low. Maybe I'll do... I feel like I'm going to need more potatoes than that. Maybe I'll do this as potatoes too. Um, potatoes here. Potato, potato. Oats. That'll be good. Um, let's check on our fish. So I think that's where we'll, what will keep everyone in as um, for farms for the next, the upcoming spring and summer. Oh, everybody's working on this house. Oh, that's not what I wanted, but okay, whatever. We'll let them finish this and then they can do all this. Um, when that's done. I can put another house in here. I was thinking about doing some wells, but maybe I'll do another house and then do wells on this side because I'm probably going to do farms, farms and orchards over here somewhere. Um, okay, let's do that. Let's plan a house. Gonna rotate. Okay, put that in here. Close that one. And then do a couple of wells next to it. Uh, 
what's in here. I'm gonna have to take the uh, terraform just a little bit more. Okay. Soon I want to start working on this area and like building up into here, but um, oh, auto saving. Okay. Um, but that I'm probably going to finish all the animals first. Okay. Let's take these guys out. Put everybody uh, that we need to in here. Put that again. Oh! The gatherer is gone. Oh, I got burnt down. Oh my gosh. Well, that sucks. Oh, I wonder if we had some more, um, if it was because of the rain or if we had raiders. It was because of the raiders. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay, well. Well, I guess I'm just gonna wait. I don't really need the gatherers and stuff right now. It, it's nice to have, but. I think maybe I'll wait and I'll build some gatherers. So that's what it be. Okay. starting to get more cows. We have two sheep too, so that's awesome. This is almost done. Is this hard? It is. So that's good. Okay. Let's see. Let's do... Okay, the, the wool is going into here, so I think having another weaver shop like right in this corner here would be helpful. Let's do that. Um... Where is that at? Right here. And then I'm going to pause that. I'm going to put another field somewhere in here for some more flats. Maybe I'll do it here. Um, if it'll fit. Nope. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's perfect. And then. I'm going to, I think I'm going to do a couple orchards here. I'm not going to build them yet. I'm just going to set them up because my plan is to get more, uh, um, some different kinds of fruit. And then um, that way I can um, get more than just a little bit. Oh, uh, food reserves are low. Ugh. Apparently I'm growing too fast. Not good. Okay, maybe I do need to put another gatherers in, gatherer in. Maybe I'll do it up here by this one. Um, gatherer. Rotate it. I need to put another well up in this area. We're losing food so fast. Okay, I can't can't have any more people for a little bit. I might need to pause one of these little houses or something. Let's pause this one. Okay. I'm gonna switch this to potato and I'm gonna gather that. Because although it's important to have the food for the animals, it's more important for my people to have food, so. And I'm going to turn this into bread. I'll just do that. And then I'm going to stop making this. Oh, 
Wow, these are really small. Okay, so I might have to do another big one or something. Let's do a couple of wells right here. about food. I was going to do more vegetable pies, but I think I'm just going to let them eat that for now. Okay. Let's see. The bad thing about food is that, I mean, for animals, we can kill some of them so that we can um, use less oats or uh, hay or whatever, but we don't want to kill the people and they eat you know, really quickly and then we're going to get low on food. I may end up needing to just do like one, like these two is grass and these two is potatoes next year. Maybe this is potatoes, just to make sure that we have something to eat. Okay, let's see. I'm going to put another person into the hunting shack, although this doesn't have a whole lot left of animals, but just in case. And maybe I should put another person in here. I don't know. Oh, gatherer. I have that now. Maybe I'll put a couple people in there just to make sure. Um, I'm going to set up a place for the pigs to go and for more farms and stuff, but I'm not going to... Maybe I'll wait. Maybe I should... I mean, I got a lot of oats here. Maybe what I'll do is I'll put the pigs here once I get rid of these. And then um, some more farms up here or something. Okay. Actually, you know what? I will keep that person in here. We still have time. It's late summer. Um, let's see. You don't need to be in there. I think next year I'm going to make this potato again instead, and then so potato. I'm going to leave this as potato, and this is potato. Still going to do with some grass as much because I need to focus. I can always kill some of the animals to use this stuff. Move that. We're gonna move all these over and all these over. Okay, well we don't need that person anymore. Um, we don't really need this person or this person. Uh, I might as well just have them finish. Hmm. Gather what they've got. Take 
them out. They need to gather. Okay, well, I think that that is where we will end this episode. Thank you for joining me today. If you liked this episode, please click the like button. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure to subscribe. And if you haven't already, leave me a comment on what you thought. We'll see you later. Hello, everyone. Sometime after the last time that I played our village of Life is Feudal Forest Village, I went back on and found out that the game save for that village was gone. So I can no longer get into that world to play it, which is really frustrating, especially since we just started getting new animals and the port and everything like that. It's just really frustrating, but I can't do anything about it. Um, because it's gone. So I'm just going to accept it and we will have to start a new world. And I'm planning to just in the first few episodes kind of edit out some of the waiting for things to be built and stuff like that so that it doesn't take quite as long. So if you enjoyed this season of Life is Feudal Forest Village, stick around because we're going to start season two and I hope to see you there. Have a great day.